also really like my large display board uh, because I hang up students' work and I have a lot of space where I can um, hang up a lot and students are very motivated to have their artwork displayed and they bring other students to uh, show them off and they, they get excited, they work harder, um, yeah, they're more engaged to do better. I, one of the things that I really, really appreciate in both rooms are the projectors. Um, they work very well because I do everything on OneNote. And so I'm able to project on the screen uh, my hot sheets, my lesson plans, and all of my uh, PowerPoints. And I can go through those with the kids while they also have those on their device as well. So they can follow along. And that's been a really big help to me. Uh, and for my uh, curriculum, the way I use the, the technology. So that's, I really appreciate having those uh, projectors. Have more space that they don't get distracted with each other as much. They can just really uh, focus and they have a bigger island space where they can do more of a collaborative work together. So that was, uh, that's been a fun experience. Our materials and tools are a lot more accessible now and in the ceramics room we have a table that's dedicated to wedging so there's more space for that so kids don't have to sit and wait for things as much as they did before. Also I can get more kids on the wheels because we actually have an extra wheel now so that means that more students are able to learn how to throw on the wheel uh, than were able, able to before. Now I have an interesting story. When they were doing demolition in room 602, above the ceiling uh, next to a wall was a time capsule that was found uh, from the 70s. And it's supposed to be opened in 2021, I believe. And so I didn't open it. I'm honoring the do not open until 2021, I think it is. I will come back, if they'll let me, to see what's in there. And uh, so that was interesting and he found it that Mike did when he was doing demo work and fortunately he kept it and he showed it to me and I said, yeah, we've got to keep that. So that should be really interesting when we open that up. Just saved in my storage room. <laughs>